Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Scarlett with Scarlett's Little Crafty Corner and I have another post review. Um, now this is another one that I had purchased through um, Equalbuy. So this was back when, like I said, when I first started diamond painting, I had gotten, went to all these different sites and I got a few from this place and a few from this place. Um, this was one that I had gotten, um, I think it was buy four, get one free or something like that. Or buy five, get one free. I don't remember. But I did purchase, mm, I think, four or five, maybe six of them from Equalbuy. But this came from Equalbuy. And it is a 40 by 30. And being that, when I purchased this, I was a newbie. I didn't realize about detail and how big, you know, your canvases are to how much detail you should be looking at. So, looking at this in the camera, it looks pretty good. Looking at this, like, right here, their faces looks like dot dot and a smiley face i mean there's no the detail is gone right there um the stove looks good the chair looks good um their bodies are a little iffy and then this is a dog um which like i said looking at it in the camera you can you can tell what everything is it looks pretty good but there again, this is going to be one of those that if I frame this and put it on the wall, as long as you don't go up and stand in front of it real close, will probably be good. Um, and again, it's a 40 by 30. It had 24 colors in it, and they were DMC charted. Um, and it's around. I didn't have any problems with this. Actually, all the canvases that I have done so far that I have purchased through e -Cool Buy have been good canvases. I've not had, you know, really any problems with them. So, you know, these are your, your cheaper, cheaper, cheaper canvases. Because, you know, we can't all afford the big boys. So, um, but this is, this has been a good one. It went pretty quick um I think I did it in two days I think um so I didn't have any problems with it the glue was fine the drills were fine I had some drills left over I just you know stuck them in with my storage my drill storage that I got going on um but yeah I I've not had any problems the shine, there, it looks pretty good. So, um, the canvas itself is that stiff, stiff canvas. Um, yeah, no problems. No problems at all with this one. Um, now, I did have a few popping issues, but... I think mostly that was my fault because, like I've said before, I'm not a perfect plaything. So, this one I kind of did different than I I usually do. Usually I'll put the, um, the release papers on here and do, you know, section by section. But this one, I left the plastic on it and I actually did, because I just wanted to see if it was faster the way some other people do it. Because some people do, you know, colors. And then they'll go to the next color. And so I tried that. Um, mm, it was okay. It's just I'm used to doing section by section. Not, you know, putting one whole color on here. And then going to the next color. So to me, the sections is a lot quicker. Plus, I stay on track. And I can stay focused with one section at a time. Um, with doing just one color at a time. 
but I was twisting and I was turning, which I do that anyway when I'm doing sections, but I don't know. It was just very strange doing color by color, and I would miss colors. I'd still have to go back and get them, so, um, but I thought, you know, hey, I wanted to just try it and see what that was like. I'll probably do my section by sections. <laughs> so, anyway, um, that's about all I got on this. Like I said, I've got, I think, either one more or two more of the little old people canvases. Cause I thought, well, because there's so many of them, and they're really cute, I think. But I, I kind of wanted to do, like, a theme. So... I don't know. I like them. But, anyway, that's that's all I got on this one with E. Cool Buy. And, I would definitely purchase from them again. Um, I've had no issues with any of them. So, anyway, I guess until my next video... If anybody has any questions or comments, just leave them in the comment section. And if you're new, please hit that subscribe button and hit the bell. That way you know when I have another video. And to all my subscribers, thank you for sticking with me. And until next video, I guess I'll see all y'all later. Bye, y'all.